How's it going, guys? This is my pair of golden marbles. I don't know how much gold marbles he is, but he's really nice. They're due to breed any time. These ones here ate their eggs. I actually laid them on the bottom of a pair of koi. This is all the fry right now. All looking really nice. Bunch of platinum. Is there a few marbled in there? Uh, this pair of koi here also ate their eggs. Still a pretty pair. We'll get them there. Won't be long. I'll probably be breeding again. Let's jump over here and look at the other tanks. Over here, we got a pair of double blacks. We got some fry from them over here on top of the other tank. I'll show you guys that in a minute. Another pair of koi. They should be breeding any day. We ain't really looking at grass. There's only going to raise a fry this time. We're really close to breeding that subpoena right there. Maybe looking at grass. I like that. See that in there? Too much bubble wrap. As you guys can tell, this here is my hexagon tank. It's just covered now or loading with algae. Sides are covered. It just, it just ain't balanced out yet. I think they might have laid or they're getting ready to lay. That looks to be the male. I no, can't hardly see nothing in here. But in here, you guys can see them. These here are the double black from the pair I just showed you. <coughs> uh, down in this one. <coughs> I came out of nowhere. But this one here's got panda cats. Or panda cory eggs in it. This one here's got a big flop of fungus tabs. Then from my other black pair I'll show you in just a minute. I ain't gave up on them yet because I've had them hatch out of weird stuff. Uh, this here is a is black beard. It's one of the few fish that's actually named in my tanks. Uh, that's his female. That's actually my wife's angel fish, Stripey. That's the other fish's name. And these ones here are the ones where I got the fungus eggs out of. Well, they weren't fungus when I pulled them, but you know. It happens. I pulled the water out of their tank. We'll see what happens. Well, the other day I was in here moving stuff around. I pulled out one of my little water spikes. Unbehold to me, the the male had went ahead and laid a bunch, had a bunch of eggs in there. I got them to fry, almost free swimming, and I dumped them out in the tank. And guess what these guys, big old angelfish here, did? You know what they did? They're predators. They went to town munching on them, so I threw a bunch of plants in this thing. Been fighting green water, and the plants didn't help. Let's just put it that way. But anyways, tomorrow's water change day, so everything's fine in here. I mean, the water is clean. It's got a canister filter and a sponge filter, so I mean, I ain't too worried about the water. It's just green. I don't really like green tanks, but that's... There's a lot of angelfish in here, but I got a 365-gallon Sun Sun special on it. They were fishing today. Been for a lot of days now. Little Peruvian angels are so cute. I mean, I like the little pearl scale. They're looking nice. Can't say nothing bad about my discus. They're all looking great. Except for Timmy. Little Timmy here. Timmy's a little runt. I don't know what I did. He's probably running when I got him. His tank mate when I bought him grew up just fine, looking good. They're all getting nice and thick. Not quite growing quite as fast as I'd like, but I'd rather have a nice steady growth rate. It's going good. The melons are looking good.
But anyways, guys, that's a quick look at what's going on in here all around. Hope you guys have a good day. Later, buds.